Hi guys, it's Erica. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to be sharing with you just an after dinner or an after dark or an evening time clean with me. This day I was vlogging and I started cleaning and I thought that I would just put the cleaning portion in a separate video because if you're watching my vlog and you're not really into the cleaning portion, this is just a separate video. But if you missed that vlog and would like to watch it, I will link it above. It was a pretty full and hectic day. This was filmed on uh, Thursday, March 12th, so on this day things started to get a little bit more stressful and anxious regarding things going on in the world right now. Um, we all know what's going on and we're all a little anxious and I think it's just important to remember to keep things as normal as we possibly can because life is going on and we have little children that are watching and we don't want to make them you know anxious more anxious than they need to be things are changing a lot in their lives and in our lives and our home is our refuge it's our safe place to fall when the world is crazy and the reality is we're probably all going to be spending a lot more time in our homes so basically we need to keep it organized as much as possible and functioning the best we can and I think every home functions better when it's neat and tidy and we're going to be enjoying time with our families we're going to hopefully get to spend some good quality time that maybe we've needed to spend and we haven't been able to so I think it's important to just maintain the cleanliness and the order I think it's going to make everyone feel a lot less anxious I know that I function so much better when my home is in order so so I just wanted to film this today to share with you guys maybe you're needing some motivation I know I definitely will be needing it I always need it <laughs> so I watch my videos I watch other cleaning videos to get that motivation when I just really need to get up and it really does help so if you've never watched them for motivation trust me they really do motivate you so I'm gonna hop off of here I'll hop on uh, when I need to but I hope that you enjoy this and I will catch up with you soon So I 
I'm using my shark vacuum in on the hard floors. I do still use my broom in the kitchen and in the bathroom. I just feel like it gets in and under cabinets and things a lot better. Um, if I, someone told me about an attachment for this, I'm not sure, I haven't checked into it, but I do love this shark vacuum for my dining room and obviously where I have carpeted floors. Today I'm not going to be doing the bedrooms, just the main living areas. So in case you're wondering, because I do get questions, why am I, why am I not using it in my kitchen? I just um, prefer to use my broom. So um, obviously just because of the spread of viruses and diseases, I am choosing to use this Lysol uh, recently rather than my natural Mrs. Myers cleaner, which I still love. But um, just for the time being, I'm using this. It's a little stronger and has bleach in it. And you know, we all need to be aware of wiping down surfaces and using bleach, things that can kill viruses the best we can. So keeping our homes neat and clean and using these cleaners is going to tremendously help to keep this virus from spreading even further. So I'm just wiping down my remotes. I need to um, do this quite frequently. Also, um, doorknobs is another good thing. Anything, obviously, that gets touched. So I just feel like staying on top of it is so important.
Okay, so this is going to be the last room that I clean tonight. I'm just doing a basic wipe down of the toilet and the sink and the mirrors, and then I will be finished. Okay, so I'm just about finished here tonight, but I wanted to thank you all so much for clicking on this video. I hope that it gave you the motivation you needed. Um, before I go, I just wanted to say, um, I just, it's just on my heart, I just wanted to say let's all be patient and kind with each other. The days that lies a lie ahead are full of uncertainty, and I know we're all a little anxious and stressed, but we can rest assured that our God is absolutely in control, and He is not surprised by anything going on in this world, so we need to remember to rely on Him, trust in Him. He is faithful. He loves us so very much. He loves His creation, His people, and He will never leave us, so let's remember to be kind and to check on our neighbors and our friends and our family, make sure that we are all in this together. I will be posting some more vlogs of just things going on in our lives as things unfold. As I'm sure all of you are aware, everything is changing daily. So we will be in touch. But I love you guys and I will see you in my next video. Bye-bye.